Caden better watch his back. Well, the, the Lapsovich brothers certainly have a handle on Sunset Speedway. You know, he's racing against adult men who have children, Trayton's age, a lot of respect there too. So it's good to see the, the Lapsovich name very, very strong in NASCAR racing as we're back under green and some contact between Andrew Ranger and LaCroix. Look deeper in the field. Steckley gets into the side of the three. We have a new third place. LP Dumoulin in the 47 gets by Tagliani. There you see Kennington, a couple of cars getting involved. The 25 of a cone bounces off the wall and bounces off the 06 of De Caseta. Wow, things are picking up. It's 38 laps down in the books. It's only 12 laps to go, but you still have to have a race car to finish. Oh, the cone, big damage. We talked about the CBRT team working on the 87 of Kevin Poitras in practice early on and then having to tape up body panels today that day ended early and it looks like joey mccomb gonna suffer the same fate in the 25 full course caution fourth caution of the day here in the juliawine.com 50. wow and there's another tore up race car and that is carlos de Caseta. and looking out the front windshield you can't really see much absolutely and and over to the oh carry mix not real happy He's got a tore up 0-2 as well. The Johnsonville Ford Fusion of Kerry Mix going to look for pit lane. He has body panels hanging off that one. But this one, the worst of the damaged race cars by far. Have another look at what started this. This is heading through the Duplessis gate. Look at the 25. There he is. Yeah, he, got, he gets tangled a little bit right there. There's Kerry Mix. He's heading down the bottom to get out of trouble. And up, it just all breaks loose right about here. This is on board with the 0-6. Well, the 25 dom dive bombs down the inside. He had to turn back right because he was going to hit the inside of the gates. And that's when the stuff really, and I don't understand what happened there. He was forced left right into Kerry Mix, who really was an innocent bystander trying to get out of trouble. And this is how it ended up for the 0-6 of Carlos de Caseta. And he stuffs it into the tire wall. That's what the heavy damage well, that's what damaged heavily the front end of that Dodge Challenger. It just wouldn't stop going in there. This is why we're under a full course caution. Mayhem pretty much everywhere.